All right, so I'm in, uh, what city am I in here? San Bernardino. San Bernardino, and I'm uh, kind of driving by, and I noticed that there's a, uh, a truck here, or a van, with um, some abortion material. And this young lady right here, who uh, I guess you ha kind of have a, a, something set up here that you're by the Family Planning Association, uh, associates, uh, tell me why is it you're here? Um, I guess would this be a protest or what yes. is it? It's a protest, but it's also sidewalk counseling. Okay. We have a, a pro life, pro life, uh, pregnancy crisis center right around the corner, okay. and we give out pamphlets to people and try to encourage them to go there instead of here. Okay, but it, it, it says here on their thing, it says family planning. So I know that that does include Abortions. abortion. It does, but it also has planning. I mean, I don't know personally because I've not walked in there, but if it does have planning, it seems like they're giving options, and I, and I do know enough about it to know that they, they have um, options. And so one of them might be abortion, but the other one might be uh, in regards to uh, other options. And I think that's the last one they want to go to is abortion. I don't think that they're, you know, as far as I can tell, they're not commercializing and saying, hey, come on in here and get a really good deal. So what's the difference between what you're doing what and they're what doing. they're doing? Obviously, you don't have the abortion option, but no. what's the difference? The difference is we will direct people to a pregnancy crisis center that will help them at any stage of their pregnancy to keep their baby. Here, they don't help them to keep their baby. Okay. They, they've they got a financial interest. They get paid for make, doing abortions. Okay. And that has to be considered. Okay. Um, well, in doing that, uh, you know, I understand what you're saying. One of the things that I'm wondering, and I know this probably comes up a lot, what if, I mean, it's, un it's unfortunate, but what if a woman is raped or what if it's, uh, let's say it's a family member? Uh, is there any, on your side of the fence here, is there any consideration for what, you know, what happens if the, uh, the mother has the baby? I mean, that to me would seem like a more traumatic thing if they decide to have the abortion early enough. I mean, obviously, if you get to a certain point, uh, it's, it, it is what you're looking at here, the third trimester. It, 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 you know, it, it's a very difficult decision, but it is rape. Yes. How do you deal with that? The way we deal with that is to point out to the woman that... Abortion is not a healing process. It's, it's not a, a healing process. It's an additional wound okay. that she's inflicting on herself. And, and we have information about how women after an abortion have like 600% more likelihood of okay. being murdered or committing suicide oh, in the okay. following year. All right. They have uh, a chance. Their fertility is affected in the future. Okay. They're less able to conceive. Uh, a, th a third of them will never have another pregnancy. Okay. And they have a much higher incidence of breast cancer and of depression. Okay. And of abuse in their relationships. And and let's say that the person is just for just for you know uh, conversation's sake here. Let's say the person's a, a mass murderer, uh, winds up raping a woman. She survives and, and winds up having the baby. I, I mean. That, to me, although I understand abortion is very difficult, any decisions we make in life are always difficult. We have to deal with them. But if you're talking about someone who's a mass murderer and has that mental makeup, I mean, that's going to be probably in the child. And you're going to wind up having to deal with, uh, you know, that emotion and keeping the baby. I I'm not trying to be pro or con. I'm just throwing some conversation at you. What's that about? I mean, what would you say about that? One thing I would say is that they have uh, facilities for helping with adoption okay. over okay. at this pregnancy crisis center. Too. So you want that baby that would be from a mass murderer and not wanted and possibly have that mental makeup to be pushed to someone else? We don't believe that anybody is genetically engineered to be evil. We okay. believe that all children are conceived with the potential for good. And, sure. we and want love. Them to and yeah. we want them to have that opportunity, equal opportunity under the law. Okay. We Do you see any value at all in what they are doing here or in uh, 
Well, I guess you could say the thing that always concerns me, and, and it is great that you're a woman I'm speaking to you, you get a choice. And sometimes to me, there isn't a side that I do see that I think sometimes our Washington uh, uh, big boys there, the older men, uh, make decisions for women. And, and, and uh, does that bother you at all? Well, I'm pro-life. Okay. As a woman, I see abortion as being exploitative and abusive to women. Okay. So, But I'm don't you want to make your own decision? I mean, you're te technically, the man is making, in our country, the man is making the decision for you. Do you see that, or do you see it because you're on their side that, you know what, I'm on their team and they're on my team? Well, yes, they're on my team, but also what I see here a lot is men losing their rights. A lot, I see women coming here and not giving the father a say, and I he see. should have a say. Absolutely. Can I have one of your pamphlets? Do you mind? You can have one of my pamphlets. Great. And you can have one of my crosses. Are you serious? Yes. Oh, you're a sweetheart. Well, look at that. Well, we can have I... have a man who makes those. Well, that's a wonderful thing, and I appreciate it. What's your first name? Mary. I'm Will, and I hope you have a great day, madam. Will, thank you so thank much. You. We'll you. Thank you. We'll talk to you soon. Thank you very much. Where will the report be coming out in? Um, it's called the SOP.